So it's super simple. All you need is two packages of mending braces. They, well really, this is four. You only need six total. So we have eight, but you only need six. We just got these from Lowe's. And this is um, National Hardware. Two economy magnet catches. Um, we got white, but this is so that it'll go up here so that when you shut the door it's not like swinging into the closet it'll hit this magnet and stop and then the only other thing you need which this is optional if you already have handles on your doors but you just need hardware to open and shut your doors ours are these little knobs but we don't like those so we're gonna replace them we have a drill to help us but that's it super super simple all right so here are the bifold doors that we have now they just shut like that. When it's like it is normally, it's really hard to get back in here to get something like the doors in your way. So by opening it up, we're gonna have a lot more room and it'll be easier to see everything we have. We pulled that tab out. All right, so to get that out, let me zoom in on. you just pop that under, stick your finger in there, pop it under and take it out of the track. And then you're going to pull it open. So all you do is push it down and then it comes out of the track. And then we're going to put braces um, on top, middle, and bottom to make it a flat door. So then it just opens and closes like a regular door instead of folding in and taking up some of this wall space. Alright, so all she's doing now is taking pliers and she's pulling off the little knob that was on the track. So now that we got that one out, she's gonna take the second one out on the other door. Do this with a partner, guys. I'm gonna hold this so the door doesn't bend and she's gonna put the brace on. still bowing a little whatever we didn't have that one down. We're gonna put a magnet right there so that the door catches right here and it doesn't go past the point of the threshold. <laughs> so the next thing you're gonna do is take your spare piece of wood and your magnet catch which comes with one piece. This goes on the door and then this will go on your door frame. So you just are gonna put it up depending on how long your spare piece of wood is and you're just gonna find the perfect placement for how it fits with your door. And so we measured that when we close this door, it's gonna come right about right here. So we're just gonna screw this block into the frame and then we're gonna put the magnet on right here for the door to catch so that it will stay and it won't go past this point. magnet into the door and all we did was like visualize we're like oh well car goes right about there and then we made a mark and we screwed it in so now as you can see catches it's magnetic now the final touches we're going to do is take these handles out fill in the holes and we're going to add our own handles like stay tuned to see what we're going to do as far as repainting and decorating but there you have it that is how you convert 
two bifold doors into French style doors. If you liked this tutorial and want to see more, give this a thumbs up and a comment below letting me know what you'd like to see. This house is old, it was built in the 80s. Which thumbs isn't, up below! It's not super old, but it's old enough that there are DIYs that we want to do around the house. So if you like these kind of videos, let me know and we'll make sure to keep filming them. If you thought that it was not helpful, I'm sorry for wasting your time. Come back another time, maybe we'll entertain a different time. <laughs>